Hello world, I'm Wilma C. And I'm on my way to Houston, Texas. This is the first stop, a pretty famous outlet mall called Katie Mills. We're gonna stop here, get something cool, and then we're going to eat. Here at the Waffle Bus, their standalone location. We got a couple of waffles coming soon. Some sweet, some spicy, and a original. To wash it all down, we got an Arnold Palmer. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. That looks good. Thank you. We got our three options here. We're in Houston now, we've got the syrup ready. This is the CB&J waffle. So cookie butter, strawberry preserve, and bananas. CB&J. Let's see if we can. <coughs> very good, very sweet. <coughs> But don't breathe in when you're eating powdered sugar. <laughs> it's really good though. Very sweet. They don't skimp on the bananas. So you're getting about, I mean, it looks like two bananas worth of banana on your waffle. It comes out really, really fast. Maybe less than 10 minutes. See you at the next spot. So we're gonna check out some gardens, but it's pretty hot. We're gonna go and get some AC and maybe a refreshing drink. We checked out the hall, it just opened. We were kind of too early. So we're not gonna get anything from there, but we will try to find some really good Indian food. So I will see you at the next stop. Stopping at a local Houston chain. Hopefully you can see that. I'm gonna get some water, some supplies, and continue on with the journey. Houston's very own. We're on the way to get some Indian food and we stopped by here in this little, I guess, Chinatown at Tapioca House.
taro milk tea. It's good stuff. Grew up drinking a lot of boba. And I'll never stop. What about you, Nicholas? What'd you get? Lychee. Lychee. Like childhood. <laughs> Tastes like childhood. Tastes like lychee and then boba we had all the time. Yeah. Tastes like a combination of driving in Chinatown in downtown Toronto, eating lychees and going to get boba. Houston has a pretty big Indian Pakistani community. So there's a lot of plazas like this one that we're in right now. We're in the Savoy complex or Savoya complex. We're gonna get some food. First we're gonna try the Sikh beef kebab. Mm. It's grilled, it's smoky, it's hot. It's very good, juicy. Everything you want in a kebab. Next we're going for dal tarka. And then with that. Mm. Nice and hot. Creamy, great lentil soup. All right, this is a chicken dish called chicken karai. Get a little bit of chicken in there. Spin this around. Mm. Oh yeah. Some fresh ginger on the side. Lots of spices. A little bit spicy. It's super fresh. Ah! And this is Nahari. You gotta swim, basically, a meat pool. Do a nice Michelin's bite with some ginger. And I'll show you this monster piece. This is gonna be sad, but it look good. Oh my gosh. Very good, but don't burn your mouth. <laughs> and of course, the garlic naan. Yeah. Now I don't even have to look at the butter glistening on there. Oh my gosh. That butter, that's the good stuff. Right over the top. Some pistachio ice cream, aka pistachio kofi. They take the kofi and they chop it up for you. Mm. It's very good, especially after I burned my mouth. While I was eating, I had to peel the blister skin out of my mouth. So, yeah, be very careful because the food here is really hot and really, really good. We just got done here at Savoy Restaurant. That is probably the best Indian food I have had outside of Canada or my mom's house. So definitely, definitely check it out if you're in the Houston area. Um, even honestly, if you're in Dallas or Austin, drive three plus hours. It's totally worth it. This place is amazing. So it is here at the Savoy Savoya Complex. Definitely, definitely try it out. Be careful, all the food is piping hot and it is absolutely amazing. The best service I have had at any Indian restaurant to date. trip to Houston, Texas. Man, I am so full. Got about a three hour plus drive back. And um, man, Houston is, I think, very underrated in terms of cleanliness and grub because the food there is amazing. I plan on going back to eat some more friggin' amazing waffles. Amazing, amazing Indian food. So definitely, Check out Houston if you haven't. 
Let me know if you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.